and happy holidays! I'm Catherine from the Books Marketing Team, and I'm here to help you get your new books device set up quickly. So just follow along and it will be ready to use in no time. When you first get your device out of the box, it will display the power off screensaver. Go ahead and hold the power button for a few moments to start the device. First, you will have to pick your language and time zone. Then your power options. Next, you get to pick whether you want a navigation bar or to use the bottom swipe gestures to navigate your screen. You can customize these settings later, so just pick one now. Same with the side gestures. Now that you're in the device, let's go finish setting up navigation first. Find the settings icon and tap system navigation or gestures depending on your device. You have the options of a nav bar or what I personally prefer, swipe gestures. Finally, find the Navibol app on your device to adjust or remove the Navibol. Pause here and play around with the navigation option so that you can see which one you prefer. Next, go ahead and pull down from the top right corner and access the control center. If you're using books as a distraction-free device, turn on the do not disturb and mute notifications. Then you can touch the edit pen on the top corner to add or remove settings, to personalize it to what you need. Next, let's take a look at some of our built-in apps. Some to pay attention to are the Bookstrap app, which is how you can easily share things with your device, the Neo Browser, which is our browser made for e-paper, and the Google Play Store. But first, let's open the Neo Reader app. The icon should look like a book. This is Books' reading app, and you can customize it to fit your style. From any book, you can access more by touching the center of the screen. Here, you can change the style of your text and adjust reading settings like font size, margins, and line spacing. Now let's look at the Notes app. You can create a new note and pick any template. In the note, you can click the three dots to customize the toolbar and add or remove whatever functions you want on your main navigation. Finally, you can change the aesthetic of your device. To change the system font, go to Settings, then Display, then Font Style. You can also customize the screensaver in Settings or by finding the Screensaver app. That's it! Now you're ready to start enjoying your new device. Remember, you can go back and readjust these settings later. Please give a like and subscribe. Happy holidays, and I'll see you next time for more books content. Bye.